Bill 21 is systemic discrimination, point blank. Groups and advocates against Quebec's secularism law, Bill 21, are throwing their support behind a petition at the National Assembly, calling on the government to revisit sections of the law. They say Bill 21 discriminates and attacks the fundamental rights of religious minorities and disproportionately impacts women. The reason we're doing this, um, we are not alone in contesting Bill 21 or any of its sections. Uh, along with uh, multiple groups, uh, we're just one of many. Uh, we're just doing this approach because we want to remind people that the bill is still coming, um, that there is opposition, and that there's someone else also that's on your side that's trying to, uh, uh, to, to, to make change. The law bans public servants, including teachers and crown prosecutors, from wearing religious symbols at work. Bill 21 um, has been in place since 2019. And it has come in the way of the careers and dreams of many Quebecers who choose to wear the kippah or the turban or a hijab. And too often, we get calls and emails from Quebecers directly targeted by Bill 21. They are unable to pursue their careers. They are unable to practice their basic rights. This is what Bill 21 does. We don't want this bill to be used as a discriminatory tool by Monsieur Legault and his government. Um, we understand that we live in a secular society. However, we want this to not work against the society that we're all trying to collectively live in and build. Uh, what I mean by that is um, we need new doctors, new uh, teachers, new uh, government employees all the time. It creates a second class of citizenship. It says it's okay for women to be disproportionately discriminated against. And the trivialization of such discriminatory actions is simply unacceptable here in Quebec. Advocates hope the petition will put additional pressure on Quebec to rethink the law. As a society, we make decisions uh, and we have rules set into place to protect minorities' rights. And in those minorities' rights, we have freedom of religion, freedom of choice. So how is it just to ask a person to have to choose between the religious identity, the religious freedom, the, free relig the freedom of expression, and their dreams and aspirations. Our right tells us uh, equal uh, under the charter, and we don't believe that the usage of the notwithstanding clause by Premier Legault uh, is adequate in this instance. Uh, we are not alone in believing so. We think it's abusive. We think it sets a dangerous precedent, and we think that anybody trying to bring societal changes should involve the society uh, in the discussion. The petition expected to go live on the National Assembly website by early next week will run until June 10th. 500 signatures are required for it to be discussed at Parliament. In Montreal, Brittany Enriquez, City News.